Sucks because I got no money. Oh, right here. Okay. Okay. Tell me who you are. I'm a bad man from out of the east. You don't know, aka John Gatti. I may have the girls, I'm lucky. You know? So when you're <laughs> I don't understand anything you're saying. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I don't understand. I'm sorry. <laughs> He's messing around. This guy's messing around. This man over here, this is Charles. Sex finest Bay Area zone. That's right. You know, I don't take orders, so leave me alone. Oh my Jesus. So I, mean, I don't have a problem with authority. I also like being pointed and told what the fuck to do. Please. Stop pointing at the me. You're pointing I'm, at I'm me right now. Because I don't like to be pointed at. <laughs> <laughs> so today's video is how to load a truck. So for today's tutorial, uh, can you give step one how to load a truck for people that need to move and get their own U-Haul? Yeah. First of all, start off with all your ugly shit. What's the ugly shit? Tell them, break it down for them. Your small PBO boxes, which are usually packed by owners, which don't never last. They crush, they break because they're like balloons. So PBO is packed by owner. So the thing is, is if you guys go move yourself and you're going to go rent a U-Haul truck instead of hiring us, you're probably going to have a lot of broken stuff. But... Me some flats. Top load. Top load, top load, top load. I don't know about that weird shit. There's no room for that. We have top load, top load. Top load, top load. Yeah, I gotta move some of this so I can get some wood up here. Hey, we can't. We need big wood. He's bringing the wood. We're talking about furniture. Yeah. <laughs> so, 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 so when you go live, right? I am live right now. I know, but you talk to everybody all around the world, man. Yeah. But you ain't spoke to anybody about Donald Trump. Why is this? Are you a supporter? Huh? Are you a supporter? Are you scared of him? See, then Are you scared right you gonna get a tweet by the president? <laughs> <laughs> hey, you see you sign up for YouTube? That'll be in another video. Today's video is how to load a truck. <laughs> That's a YouTube match? Right? Yeah, yeah, I am. On. We're on YouTube right now. We're on live. Oh, you're on live YouTube? No, this is live for real. Hey, Thousands of people are watching. What you doing? Huh? What we doing? Uh, they're watching you right now. They're watching me? Yeah. Hey, people, what's going on, man? We all up in the building. Oh, what is this? A truck? I'm from the country. I don't know, man. You're not from this country? No. I'm from a country where you don't speak. Oh, my Jesus. Walk and talk. And talk and bumba clot dead. I have no <laughs> clue what you are talking about. <laughs> all right, thank you. You want to know? All right, hey. so... So, um... Talk to these people like they're renting a U-Haul truck. So if you go and rent a U-Haul truck, um, do you... Hey, Jamaica. Those two pieces right there. Yeah, those two pieces of wood. Can you get that for me? Like, hit them up, wrap them. So first off, uh, what kind of uh, tools do they need uh, before uh, moving their own furniture? Uh, ladders, dollies, what, what should they bring with them? Or what should they rent from U-Haul? What, what should they do? Talk loud, they can't hear you. If you don't get your own you uh your own dollies, you know, mag liners, you know, you gonna rent it from U-Haul for ten dollars, which is But that this, this for the people today, this is a tutorial today for people that are gonna move themselves. How much people watching you oh. right now? Yeah, do it yourself. Three people watching get you, you a U-Haul, go uh -huh. get some guys from the corner. Guys from the corner, what yeah. corner? In the corner. Uh, Home Depot. Are they From the gonna corner be... of Home Depot. Wait up. What? Do really? you gotta pay them cash or Pay them oranges, you can give them oranges, <laughs> I'm just saying. You know, everybody just talks numbers, man. I hear that. A couple guys a can of beer, you know, and let them work to the thirsty again. And then, so, um, do you recommend that they uh, pack their own items, or do you recommend that they uh, uh, go and actually have professionals pack their items before they move it? Well, to be honest. If they're going to pack it, if they're trying to save money, what? I, would, I would say pack it yourself. And what's the best way to pack uh, furniture or boxes? I mean, Lots should, of paper. Lots of paper? So, so real quick, so people that don't know, imagine Frito-Lay chips. When you open a bag of Frito-Lay chips, the chips is at the bottom, right. and then it's all air on top. Right. So this is actually a good packed box right here. Know how to consolidate. And what it is is the items are actually only filled up to here, and then the rest is paper. And if you do that, then it won't be crushed. Um, we, got, we got some good movers here today. These guys are excellent. We're moving out of a, a warehouse, you know, so I did not pick up anybody from any corner. These guys are actually paid professionals. Woo! You know. I'll buy that for a dollar. <laughs> All right, we're going we're gonna to watch as... Now, Now tell me what you're doing, sir. Right now, I'm padding up this furniture right now if it didn't get scratched. Okay, uh, so uh, what are you... Uh, they don't have... Uh, 
You're using pads? Is that what we use? Yeah, we're using blankets. Yeah? Yep. It's a blanket to the furniture. Okay. And, and rubber band, we don't use tape. Okay. It damage the, the blanket. So we're using rubber band, so it's stretch. You know? Right. So what you're going to do, you're going to secure all four corners of the, of the furniture. Let me mm. you know that. They're watching you. They know it now. Yeah. They're learning. You know that they're coming up. Face. Yeah. So, protection. Protection's important, guys. Yeah. Without protection, uh... I always use protection. Just to be safe. Without protection, Practice. we don't do nothing. So there we go. Uh, would you call this a, a great pad job? Or no. would you call this a, a uh, decent we, one? No, this is not a great pad job because... Well, it's only decent because he doubled it. Okay, let me show you now. You can pick it up. Okay, do it better. All right, show them, show them from the beginning. So, hey guys, so when you have your furniture. When you have your furniture, you get professional movement to come in. Right. And make sure you're taking care of, like you're taking care of your own stuff, you know? That's right. So you drape the top. Put the floor in, get the next side. So for everyone watching right now, he's showing you guys how to wrap your furniture if you ever need to move it yourself. Okay. That's right. So he's getting all four sides in. Oh, they don't want to be in the video. Look at this, he man. He man. <laughs> Look at this guy, man. Look at that, man. Boat. He moved a whole boat when it was full of people. Full of Shoot, people. man, you probably moved my family over. Bad motherfucker, man. And drop no race. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me get the other one. So we're loading up. We're loading up. We're showing you guys. So we're padding it. He's gonna show you one more time. Look at this, man. These guys got super strength, superhuman strength. I know sometimes I get comments like, "Hey, Alex, why don't you move the furniture yourself?" I do move the furniture, but you know what? It's the drive that you have that moves the furniture. Some days, if you don't move the furniture, but you're paying guys and you're helping them feed their family, what's wrong with that? Right. Oh, what we, what we need, what we need. Okay, this is rubber band. Rubber band man? Rubber band man. Rubber band rubber man. Band. I don't like I it. <laughs> I know this guy's the most stylish mover. Look at them shoes. Wearing some loafers. Look at that. No. <laughs> Shut up. There we go. We pad the furniture, we take care of the furniture, that's what we do. So he puts one on top. So here's the thing guys. When you guys move yourself, I'm telling you this right now. I see it all the time. People rent a U-Haul truck. They don't get any pads, they don't get any dollies, and then they throw they throw their items just in the U-Haul truck and when they get there, half the things are broken. You know what I mean? Busted and disgusted. Busted and disgusted. So the thing is, if you are going to move yourself, you know, do it right. You know what I mean? If you're going to move yourself, do it right. That's all I got to say. If, you're not, if you know you're not going to do it right, and let's be honest, if you don't move yourself, 
after the first time you move yourself, the next time you're gonna ask for professional help, right, Charles? You gonna pay, or you gonna pay for it? That's right. You gonna pay, or you gonna pay for it. That's how it goes, man. It is the moving business to the fullest? What's going on, guys? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, Bear Burns? What's up, Ron Lawrence? What's up, Philippines Trucker? Look at this, man. He, man. Oh my gosh. A whole sofa. But when he puts it down, he puts it down gently, like a, like a, look at that, like a baby's bottom. The way he takes care of things. Look at that, man. You the man. So now he's gonna show you real quick. Charles is gonna show you how he loads the truck. Okay. So, what are you doing right now? Tell the people what you're doing, man. I'm loading the truck piece by piece. Piece by piece. And what are you putting on the bottom? Is there a difference between putting stuff on the bottom and top? Yeah, you want to put the base on the bottom, man. The heavy wood. What's the base? I don't, they don't know what a base is. Heavy wood dressers. Uh, you know, countertops. So basically, yes. anything that's sturdy enough to load on top of. So it makes sense, but you're gonna want to put the heavy stuff on the bottom and light stuff up there. What's up? Oh, uh, wrapping the lawn. <laughs> That's right. So the thing is, you usually don't care about the lawn stuff, but here's the thing: the lawn stuff is metal and it's sharp, and it could damage other items. So that's why you wrap it up. You wrap up the lawn stuff so that it doesn't damage other items. That's the reason. A lot of military boots. You have to wrap everything. Yep. Look at that. Look at that, baby. Look at this. this guy look like he's ready to go to the office job. Give me a thousand. This man right here, he wants a thousand hits. Look at that. Give us a thousand hits, a billion likes. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Oh no, they they love it. They just watching. They just watching right now. The thing is, right now it's uh, either early or people are working, so not everybody's watching it. But the thing is, is when it uploads onto YouTube, people people watch it later. So the thing is, regardless if they're watching live now or they're watching later, they're gonna still see you. Yeah. They call this man Jamaica. That's his nickname. That's what Charles calls him. I don't call him that. You call him Jamaica. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's messed up. What up, Leon? What up, Leon? What's good? What's good? Look, so that's what we do here. We go on the truck empty-handed. That's <laughs> Yep. So what we doing is we just load in the truck. Oh my gosh. Watch yourself, watch yourself, watch yourself. Watch yourself. Oh my gosh. Beautiful, beautiful. Is that staying? What happened? No, there we go. That's it. Jeremy Lee. Come in. in. Jeremy Lee. Did you just call me Jeremy Lynn? Because I responded to that. Yeah, you did. So, 
Feminine. Let's see, what'd you say, Leon? Bro, it's hard to get a driving job straight out of prison. Any advice? Uh, honestly, brother, uh, there's a lot of uh, uh, companies that hire out of prison. It just matters what it's for. If, if it's for, like, contraband stuff, then usually, I'll be honest, they don't, um, they don't uh, yeah, you know, help you with that. Theft, any theft, money, embezzlement, embezzlement or uh, drug trafficking, uh, they don't. But if it's something else, like, you know, a bar fight. But, again, it's not my right to judge. You know what I'm saying? What you need to do, brother, is just... Go out, go out and um, uh, apply at, you know, the New Englands, the Swifts and all of them. And, you know, explain your story, man, because I'll be honest, man. Everybody has a situation and everybody, we've all made mistakes, man, regardless of what it is, man. We're all human beings, brother. But overall, um, try out. Uh, I've heard uh, New England and Swift, uh, they're pretty good. They, uh, they usually uh, hire people with uh, uh, past records, but... Oh yeah, Carolina Cargo. I heard uh, they actually uh, help people as well. That's what I'm saying, brother. Uh, um, the see, you're saying what? It was a shooting protecting my family, uh, my brother. See, there you go. That has nothing to do with. See, what they're nervous about is that you're gonna go across the country, and if you have a record of drug trafficking and driving across a state, bringing illegal stuff, that's what they're worried about. You know, you tell them the story that you're protecting your family. And then next thing you know, you know, it's a situation where, you know, it just didn't go in your favor. Hey, man, I think uh, I think you have something there. The only thing now is I think a lot of companies like to see five years off your record. So, um, you know, don't quote me on that. But that's what I've seen from companies that I uh, I talk to. So, you know, just give it some time, man. But, you know, in, enjoy while you're doing your thing, brother. And I'm, I'm glad that... Um, you're trying to do better, brother. Because that's all we're all trying to do. Do better. Are you going to put up all the patio chairs down or what? Might as well. White tier. Yeah. You got help? Oh. oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. See, uh, 2012. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm talking to oh, one of my uh, subscribers. Uh, I don't know if he recently just got uh, out of prison or what his situation, but he had an account in 2012. So I think you're you're good, man. If it happened in 2012, um, you know you're 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 past the time, the five years. So check out the Carolina Cargo. Check out a couple spots, man. What, man? So every mover hates patio chairs. Man, that edge is gonna. If it shifts, it's gonna break, bro. No. Yeah. yeah. You know, honestly, I don't know that. So, uh, the best thing to do, brother, hit hit them up and uh, get the requirements from them, man. You know what I mean? Because I'm here, you know me, I'm here for positive vibes. I'll never say that you can't do it. If you want something bad enough, you could get it. I'm telling you that right now. Just don't go office chair and uh, uh, put those uh, sharp ass patio uh, legs and <laughs> rip it. Oh, you're welcome, brother. What, we watching music videos? We can start rapping. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, show them how to wrap a chair. Show them real quick how to wrap a chair. Uh, you know, I've tried my best. It's my, uh, my first week. This I'm, is his first week, first guys. Day of my first week. <laughs> you know, black people, we call that sick a lot. <laughs> my allergies hit me in my first week. I couldn't breathe. Did you just say black people call it sick a lot? <laughs> you call them sick a lot. Man, I, you know, I, I don't want to say Before you hire us, I'm just giving, keeping it 100, man. Can you stop? This is a professional video. They're going to promote this at U-Haul. <laughs> for moving. That's funny. We got a guy over here doing a chair. We got a guy over here doing a chair. We got this, this is called two chairs.
Two chairs. So what are you doing right now? Uh, kind of what you just said. About to pad this chair up. Look at that, man. You see that right there? He used to be a, a, a cattleman. He used to uh, uh, drop uh, cattles on the floor and then uh, rest them to the ground. You see how he did that? Somebody that's watching this don't know me. <laughs> Look at these guys, man. This is a half of the Look at that, man. Pot it up, pot it up. What if it looks for me? Looks good, brother. These guys did all this work and we've only been here for about an hour and a half. <laughs> Not my name. I didn't hear them say the Asian Vin Diesel. I didn't turn around. Nothing else on the deck, please. The thing is, uh, what's up, Vic? What's going on, brother? Yeah, I'm out here with uh, Mr. Jamaica and Mr. Charles. Mr. Charles right here is uh, loading the truck. As you can see, these guys have you ever heard of Tetris? Because this is what these guys are doing. These guys are doing real life Tetris right here. Tetris, geometry. Yep. Yes, sir. So let me let me tell you guys. Did you see that glass? So when you guys see glass, we put cardboard to protect it. So let me go grab some cardboard, which I have a lot of. There's a patio chair back here too. You know this load wouldn't have been that bad without patio chairs. Let's grab. There it is. Yeah, I'm still in sack, brother. I'm about to leave. I'm going to Hayward right now after this. Load up, load up, and dip. Load up, load up, and dip. Oh, you okay? You need to sit down. <laughs> <laughs> You're too strong, man. This is a blue one. Man down in action. What do you think, this way? Yeah. Perfecto. There it is. Yo, 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 we're loading the truck. This is not really a how-to video. This is just kind of showing us, showing you guys what we do. Now the front of this has glass, so what we do is we get the cardboard, we put the glass on. Or not the glass. Oh, look at that. How smart is that, man? People don't know about it. I have not, uh, I haven't worked out yet, but no big deal. One more on the bottom would be good. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at me helping out. Look at me helping out. Ready? Go 
Look at that. That's the ticket right there. That's the winning ticket. There it is. This guy pick up everything. Yep. You don't need a hand truck. You don't need a hand truck? No. Oh my Jesus. Um, it just matters. Unload is faster. Um, and you know, we just take care of people. Yeah. We, uh, um, it, it could take anywhere between five hours to eight or ten hours to unload. Fifteen. Hey, someone said that guy is strong. Huh? I don't know what that is, but it looks heavy. This thing's heavy. This thing weighs at least uh, 300 pounds. Yeah, yeah don't pick that up. Don't pick that up right now. <laughs> and for videotaping, I'm, I'm the one videotaping today, but usually I'm the one doing all the work. But for today's videotaping purposes, uh, I'm not. So please don't judge me, guys. Please don't. Yeah. He said deadlift all day long. Charles is low on the furniture, as you see on the bottom. Base, heavy items. As you get higher, we're looking at um, lighter items. There's a ladder too, a yellow one. You might be able to burn that. Uh -oh. That wasn't in the video. No, we don't use that. We don't use shoulder dollies. We we just use this guy. <laughs> this guy just picks up refrigerators. He picks up couches. Man. Fix up everything in the house. Microwave, the smallest stuff. I want my grandmother hat. Rubber neck. Alright, you make you load me up, man. Shout out to Brittany for cooking breakfast for Trey. That's what we're talking about. People want shout outs to today. We're doing it. Yeah, man. Big up, whoever. Big up, you know what I mean? Big up, big up. Rah! I saw them balling out like a dog. Cause you don't want to put me in this video cause you're living too young. For we big up to my agent friend him on a YouTube video. You know? I, I didn't understand a word don't he said. Worry. Because it sounds so sexual, man. <laughs> 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 This is that's probably ripping up that's probably ripping up all the chairs. What? Sorry. I'm just joking. This man's the man. He know what he's doing. No, I don't. This is our Look at this. Star. Look at this, man. He even know how to load it where look, this won't touch this. Look at that. How this crazy is, is that? This is a moving star. No matter where you come from, no matter where you are. This is a DJ, no mess with up star. This is a moving star. No matter where you come from, we will really live far. Say in a California where you sit down on a far. You drive up your truck and you drive so far. In a London, Brooklyn where you live far. Uh, Me and my friend uh, that go to the bar. We all load up your truck for take it overseas. Travel to the western journey, you see. Where everybody look and blah, see blah. the highway. Say run the microphone and me no hey. look. Me no sum up no weed, cause me do a good job Liar. Wake up the morning, me know me not free Look out of that a police or a siren Look to me window, everything cloudy oh. When me a chuggle, send me trouble with brownie oh. <laughs> 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 Give me the other chair That was amazing oh, what did you say? But it no like me. It sounded I didn't know what, was he speaking English? Hey, I don't speak no English Jamaicans, yeah, right. Jamaican Alright, let's try something now. You know, speak no English? Alright, you know, so everybody could do this now. Hey, let me get that brown. Right there. Chair, chair, chair. <laughs> I, why, I, but why do they always go like, bloop, bloop? Bloop, bloop. Sorry. That means it's good. Good? Play back again. Play back again? Play oh, back again. I thought, boop, boop, boop. I thought that meant bad area. Don't go. Play it back again. When it's bad, you say play it back again. Listen. 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 
Listen, you know, I know everybody got work and everybody got school. Listen, 11 and 11 that is. 11 and 11 that is. Say 22. Uh huh. 11 and 11 that is. 22. 22 and 22 that is. I don't know. 44. 44 and 44 that is. 38. <laughs> Me now go work till quarter past eight. So every morning, girl, knock on me gate. Me peep to the window, me say, girl, you can't wait. Me take up my jacket and me go through the gate. I already go again and say, you want to test my feet. I saw my written cassette and I saw my written tape. Uh. Me come a dance and get me lyrics in my taste. Write a letter, me I go write one letter. Mm. Write a letter, me I go write one letter. Me say, hello, mommy. How do we? I hope daddy now kill you with beating. Boop, boop. <laughs> <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> hey man, bring me out of the chair. Man, these guys, man, they're having too much fun moving. I think they're gonna have to pay me for allowing them to help me. Hey, hey, we're not sitting out of the chair. Out of the chair. This is going right here. Are we in the brown chair? Yeah, I'm brown. John, send your pussy from. Send your stuff on the That guy's crazy. He's excited now. You do. Put him on tape. He's like, this is gonna make it to Jamaica? <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Instant yeah. gratification. Instant sensation. Charles said you're excited because you on uh you're gonna be on YouTube famous. So to be a rapper anyway. Who, 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 who is that? You just gave him this moment, man. This is your right. moment. You can go see yourself. I got, I got a YouTube video too. Yeah, I got one on my phone. Really? Do it, do it. Do it. Me do it for the fans and me do it for oh. the fans. My uh, my wife is in Florida. My wife is married, and he's a single man. Sometimes. What? He's not a single man, you know, but he's single with his truck. You know, no dog. Good thing I don't understand what Jamaican is saying, because <laughs> that's not like it's giving me in trouble. Hey, I, I don't speak English. I just speak my word. I know, but you're a fucking really handsome man. But you know he these muscles. Can I touch it? No, don't touch it. We shot you. Oh my god. <laughs> Full of bullets. Who shot you? I got nervous. I got nervous. Don't touch a man's muscle. Yeah, man. You love man. We know fish. Can we know swimming at this? We know right. fish. Can we know. Wait, wait, wait. He's about to be famous in Jamaica. Can we know fish? Can we know swimming at this? No man can touch me up like me. I'm <laughs> you want to hear that one? Yeah? Come in no fish. Come in no swimming at the sea. No man can touch me no. Just like the fish see. They might call me. They don't call me on the man my total me must not know say I gun this. Me loaded, me loaded, me know me pump this. That's that was God's given talent. Give me something. Let me get a, let me get a pad. Sorry, give me something. Give me a pad. <laughs> Fucking making me die on the inside. I can't even laugh right hey, now. Hey, you know what? Someone to the camera too hard. You know you can't Put on an instrumental beat so Charles can rap. I want Charles to rap. Charles is a great rap. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're about to rap. For everybody out here on YouTube, we about. Here, look, let me pick a song. Let me pick a song. Hip hop, hip hop, instrumental. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, these guys actually help me all the time. As you can tell, they'd get mad if I did. Let's put the beat up. I can't hear it. That's as loud as it goes. Come on, Charles, start rapping. Can you hear it? Oh, you know what? I can uh, go get my uh, Bose speaker. Let me get my Bose speaker. Okay, I hear a son. All right, start rapping. Yeah. Internationally known, but locally respected. I get to rap until the mic's disconnected. Your girl get injected. I won't get infected because I practice safe sex for protection. Uh. No, no, saying, so don't need no Smith and Wesson. My words come out so smooth you get to guessing. No stressing. No fifth and four lessons. No packing, no Glock, no four Smith and Wesson. I don't need no Glock. My hand is too swift. Like Jamaican over here spitting the God's gift. Uh. You got talent and don't even know. Get your ass on the bus or get on the boat. Stay afloat. Don't let your battleship sink. 
So me no ride boat, me scare a Titanic When me step out and everybody want fit Me run fast like a Usain Bolt cause me know how to do it Me load up the truck and fly to us Usain, Usain, he's insane Yo, Met the man in pain. Give me that. Get Met it. Right there. I got it. Hey, hey, he was spitting fire like Kanye through the wire. But you know what? That's what I mean because we just chilling. I'm just feeling. Why? Because these guys just not dealing. But when they do hustle, they just moving because they moving furniture, moving fucking boxes. That's what we do. We don't shot, but we just talk shit. We just talk shit. The defecation. Defecation. Charles is black, but he's a Trump supporter. Oh, Charles is black, oh, but a Trump good. supporter. <laughs> <laughs> Jamaica! <laughs> Get him! Hey! Hey! Oh, hey! Hey! Sir! Me love me, girl, and me love me so badly. Hey. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Can you maybe get a four five in there? Four five in here? Three Let me see. On that? One five. One five. Look at these guys. Let me see that thing. That top right there. Red right top. No. 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 Macaroni sandwich. No. Yeah, so I mean, I'm gonna be checking on there, man. Cause I'm getting all these damn emails. Every time you post a video, uh, I get an email. So. Yeah. Cool. What else we got? Uh, Asian hip hop. Asian. Uh. Are you the man? What do you think about Lone Mountain? I don't know what I think about it. I don't know. Lone Mountain. You know what that's about? Mm -hmm. With heavy, with some lights, more light. Light. Uh. I got rid of all four chairs, huh? Cool. Let's do it. So what, man? You, uh, where are you going from here? Where are you next? Hayward. Hayward, huh? Bayward, out there, of course. Newark. Where you going? Uh, uh. Yeah, yeah. Listen to anime hip hop instrumentals. I just need a cup of small butt of warm up done. Hey. Hey. Yo. This beat's kinda slow, but I'll rap to it. Yo. Listen to anime, hip hop, instrumentals. Yes, it is. Yes, it's essential. But you know what? I just on my mental. But that's what we go. You just projecting. That's what we're getting. You just loading. I'm just chilling while we just flowing. But you know what? We on YouTube live. But that's what we got to do. Just stay alive. But you just moving trucks just to just to survive. But I'm chilling. We just killing. Now we almost done. I got to go to Hayward. Go to Hayward, but I'm kind of bored. Kind of bored. That shit don't look like it's gonna fit. That shit don't look like it's gonna fit. But that's what Jake Macon does is he sticks in and thrusts. That's right. He likes to touch butts. Mm, no, we don't touch butts. Butt <laughs> Here's your phone. Sounds like, uh, bounty killer. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful. Hey, this load looks great. Even with patio chairs. It's filling in. Oh, it's okay. actually filling in pretty good. Yeah. Give me, give me, uh, some of this, make this little thing. What you need? Pads. Pads. Hey, you guys need some water? Reggae beef. Yeah. All right, no, we I got some Gatorade, actually. Okay, you need a water? Or are you okay? No, I'm in the drink. Huh? You have juice? <laughs> you don't drink water? No. My friend told How me. How the hell do you stay like this if you don't drink water? I what eat a lot of fish. Jamaican rum. 
I'm gonna go get a water. <laughs> oh! Is that is that food? Yeah. Hey, these guys right here. This guy's warehouse manager. This guy's just a handsome dude right here, <laughs> chilling. Yeah. Let me get some drinks. Do you guys need a drink? Anything? Uh, no, I'm, I'm a I'm a poor truck driver, <laughs> but you know I think I'm making five dollars fifty cents an hour. So I can... cents a mile, man. Yes, sir. You already bought a drink? You already bought a drink? I was gonna buy you a drink. Oh, I'm sugar, I, really don't I was just gonna buy you a drink, take it out your pay. <laughs> hey, you good? What does your make a drink? Gatorade? Burrito? How you doing, sir? Yeah, 